To get started, I just added a video clip and an audio track to my timeline. Let's begin by going over to the media tab and clicking the new button. Select plane. Choose the black color and hit OK. Drag the black plane above your video on your timeline. Then I'm just going to extend its duration and click the eye toggle to hide it so that we can see our video while editing. Now keep in mind that while I'm going to do the flicker effect with a solid black color, you can do this with any image or video. Instead of the black plane, you would just drag the image or video above your video 1 track. Alright, next position the time into where you want the flicker effect to start in your video. I'm going to put mine where the drums come in. And let's zoom in on our timeline so that we can see it better. Then select the cut tool and make a cut at the time head's position. Press the right bracket key to move the time head forward one frame. Then make another cut at the time head's position. Now just keep moving the time head forward one frame and making a cut at each position until you've covered the portion of video you'd like to flicker. Once you're finished making cuts, delete the two large parts of your black plane before and after your cuts. Then while holding down the control key, select every other cutout clip of the black plane. Make sure you're selecting the top blue parts of the clips or it won't select it right. Hit the delete key to get rid of every other frame once you're finished. Then be sure to toggle back on the eye for your black plane's video track. Alright, and now when I play this back, I have a nice looking flicker effect. Okay, that's it for this video. Thanks for watching and see you next time.